Hi, welcome to our technical video series on how to build custom decentralized applications with the Horizon Sidechain technology. We call it Zendu. In this video, we provide an overview of the Horizon Sidechain SDK, the macro elements you need to develop in order to build your blockchain application with custom logic and data, and our application Lambo registry that we built as a demo app which will accompany us throughout the videos. Now, let's start with the SDK. The Zendu SDK consists of a set of classes, interfaces, and methods that offer all the basic components and functionalities of a complete blockchain out of the box. It includes all the key components of a standard blockchain-based architecture, an implementation of the cross-chain transfer protocol to receive coins from the main chain to the side chain, and to send them back from the side chain to the main chain, and an implementation of Lattice, a proof-of-stake consensus protocol. This code base can be extended to fully support specific application logic and business requirements, making it easy for a developer to implement the required functionalities on a fully distributed and trustless blockchain architecture. In this video, we review the five macro elements that allow any developer to implement those functions. In the next four videos, we will go through each macro element in detail. These can be listed and combined into the following groups. Boxes, box data, propositions, and proofs. Transactions, API related, custom object serialization, application state and wallet extension and sidechain app. Again, we provide more detailed technical and practical explanations about each of these elements in the following videos. The Horizon team developed the Lambo registry application as an example of a blockchain application with custom logic and data that can be created using the SDK. It demonstrates how the SDK itself can be extended to support new functionalities, including how to set up the project, how to introduce custom transactions, boxes, propositions, and proofs, how to define the API to do custom logic operations, and how to let the SDK manage all custom data. In particular, with the Lambo Registry app, we have the possibility to tokenize vehicles by providing the main vehicle attributes like vehicle identification number, also known as the VIN, the model of your car, we chose it to be a Lambo Registry, so here we mean the specific model of your Lamborghini, the year when it was produced, and so on. Another major point of this demo app is the possibility to sell your vehicles on blockchain to a possible buyer. In order to do this, the owner will need to create a sell order for their specific vehicle where the seller specifies the price they're willing to accept, the information of the buyer who wants to buy the vehicle, and other parameters. After the buyer accepts this sell order to indicate the intention to purchase, the original owner will then receive the payment in Zen, while the buyer will become the new owner of that specific vehicle. The Horizon sidechain rules complete the operation in a safe, decentralized way. In the last part of this video, I would like to show you an example of how to set up a sidechain application project and how to set SDK dependency. First, I'm going to start my IntelliJ IDA. Click Create New Project. Select Maven project. The group ID for me is io.horizon, but you can enter any value you want. Artifact is Lambo registry. Click finish. Good. Now you have a name for your project and the base structure is defined. Let's make it aware of the sidechain SDK. In the project POM file, we need to specify the external Maven dependency to the SDK. We published the Horizon sidechain SDK beta version on Maven Central, so we can reference it now.
We have just loaded the sidechain SDK with all its dependencies to our project, and now we can start developing custom business logic. What to do afterward and how to do it is going to be described in the following videos. Hopefully, you'll find our sidechain technology and our Lambda registry demo app interesting, and of course, feel free to give us any feedback. All the code is located in our GitHub repos. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.